Jones entering at random. Let's see, we beat, beat Giagi and uh, the other character, which is the, from the UK, Italy versus UK. Get ready. And we're gonna start off with the match. Tossing it Play. out, Baria Ooh. going for the little lob. And this is a peculiar stage right there, Frankie. Yes, this is a very uh, odd pick for a first game. This is going to be a little rough. Clay, as we know, the bumpers are in the middle. The hype creators, as a certain someone calls them, uh, they are not friendly to beginners. Good Biagi spin off of the excellent reflect by Varia. And he gets a three-pointer. So we're three to six right now. Uh, this is already tied. Time Bones is going to reserve the Frisbee. He's going to go for a diagonal angle, going straight ahead, moving across. Oh, he gets hit by the Frisbee. Tries to send it up. That's a super, Excellent. super lob with five points. A big five. Puts him at 11. Now, the, wow, the curse does not hold true here. 14 to six. That was a quick round. Uh, the... The bumpers really aided Varia there. They really did. Time Bones has got to be careful, or at the very least, he can. Oh, no. Oh, look oh, at those no. curves with the three points, and that, it blacks it out. The game. It, it the game. The game is broken, but now it's back, it, and we're about to resume management of the game. <laughs> Our stream could not handle the Biagi bumper baloney. That is awful. Going now, across the board, trying to go for a diagonal angle, reaches it out. That is, that is a sin. That, um, oh no, those spins. Make it a pizza. Very quick, very quick off the bumpers. It's possible for Biagi to score on himself, but it's it, it's total chaos when a Biagi super hits the bumpers. And Varia also taking advantage of all those curves that he has been practicing dead on, but those are five points right there straight for Time Bones. Let me tell you, that super by Time Bones was very good. But uh, uh, Vari is just one step ahead. We're nine to five right now. Uh, Diagonal, and we see the curbs going up 2-0. Uh, oh, shoot, the, um, uh, the players just informed me that uh, the names are swapped. Time Bones actually just dominated Varia in that first game. But Varia, despite the score, his technique is relatively sound. I'm very happy with what I'm seeing from him. Now he goes to the beach. Very smart pick by Varia. Uh, neutral stage. No bumpers to save time bones. This is what many will tell you is a true test of skill. How's this gonna go? Diagonal angle, charging up the super, going for the lob! The Ooh. lob and he pushes him inside. Those are five points and Varia starts off. Oh, almost does another five points right there. Diagonal angle, straight. He almost got another five and that could have been awful. Fives are scary when they come in twos, and it was about to come in twos, but uh, Time Bones running it back right quick with two quick threes, six to five. Trying to charge up the super as well, but that's nine to five right there. Varia intercepts with the Frisbee, going slow, charging up, not quite gonna get the super. The lobs it again. Going up, and that's a diagonal angle. Oh, straight up, that's a five points, and Time Bones takes us the first set of match our second match. Match point for time boats. Oh god. Varia going for that curved angle, charging up the super. That's gonna be the death of Varia right there. Yeah, that's it. That was a quick three off the wall. Are we going to see history repeat itself? We do not. Frisbee's in the air. Quick super lob. Uh, excuse me, delayed super lob. And anyway, results in another three points for time boats. Diagonal angles are the name of the game right now. Charging up the super once again, going for the lob. He's been going for, that, for those lobs lately, Frankie. He might be getting punished for it. Diagonal angles going straight. Another one. Charging up. Oh, that's a diagonal angle. That's a 12 and 0. And Time Bones takes the set 2 0 over Varia. We see some experience going on, on the way from Time Bones as well. This is yeah. not the first time he plays Windjammers. I forgot that. Yeah, I forgot Time Bones is not a first time player. What? NEC. Oh, my God. You did. It, Time Bones met me at NEC. Oh, my God. I've met so many people this weekend. I have, oh, man. Well, Time Bones, as you can see, the experience advantage really came to play. He really took it to newcomer Varia. Yeah, the most important part was that when he was actually throwing out those diagonal angles and he would tr throw a straight and he would use different supers as well. Yeah. Well, we saw Varia Mixed actually up. using a lot of um, lob supers. And you saw Time Bones actually staying behind just to catch him because he wasn't delaying them enough. Right. Now, the thing is, uh, yeah, it, he didn't delay the super lobs. So needless to say, uh, Time Bones was able to just stay close to the net, receive them, throw them back. Mm -hmm. And then uh, uh, Varia 
went for super lobs. His super curves, he had a few of them. They weren't bad. They weren't bad, but Time Bones was just one step ahead. And what do you think of the characters that were actually picked? Because the super that um, Varia was using actually would throw the Frisbee right off the one of the places, setting up a 50-50. But do you, do you think maybe another character would have better benefited him in this matchup? The thing is, a character is more than their super. Uh, I mean, it's, it's uh, curves, it's speed, it's throw power. I, I play Miller. I play Miller. So I uh, uh, his super... I do enjoy for the 50-50 if I know I can get away with it or if I think I have my opponent on tilt enough if I'm in their head to where they think, oh, he's throwing it low. Oh, no, he threw it high. I can't get there in time. Um, but uh, the French have a saying, as I've been telling everyone uh, yesterday, in the words of K. Kuhn, uh, if you are a first fire super, uh, you're an idiot, he says. Uh, the thing is, sometimes,